Good morning. We woke up with this. I don't know if you can tell, but this eye is outrageous. All because I think the contact was faulty. I had it on all day. I was so excited to wear my contacts yesterday. And then I woke up with this eye. Last night, I took off the contact and it was burning red. It looked like my eyeball was on fire and it felt like I was on fire. Once I took that contact off, I washed it out. And as I was washing it out, it made it worse. The fieriness of my eyeball was just like, please just put me to sleep. So then I put two eye drops in and it felt so much better. And I figured, okay, I could just sleep this off and throw those contacts out and wear new ones tomorrow. I'm not wearing contacts today I, 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 because I'm afraid I might lose an eyeball, but we're gonna try to be cute. We're gonna see what we do. I have two fresh pairs of contacts that I brought with me just in case because I always bring extra contacts, but I'm telling you that contact was made wrong. It was like this one, look at this eye. This eye is perfectly fine. Look at it, nice regular eyeball. This one, it's like, what happened? What, what's going on? It's finally starting to feel a little bit of confidence and now I'm gonna throw on those damn glasses that you've seen me in for the past forever and ever more. <sighs> and to add insult to injury. What is this? What is this, Florida? Sunshine state? There's no sunshine today. Every day has been nice and sunny, and the one weekend I need to get away, my eye decides to go rogue on me, and now the sky is going rogue on me. What is this? We're gonna still make it the best day we can, though. We're going to another fun park. I think this is my, no, wait, I can't, you know what? I can't even tell you which is my favorite park. But this is definitely top two of my favorite parks. I'm gonna get ready now, and I will see you in a second. We wore the glasses and it's still cloudy. But the ears are cute though. The curls are kind of nice. See, we got we got some positivity. We could bring some positivity into the day. See the eye, how's it doing? It's still red, it's still very red. It's all right though. We're gonna go. Oh, I still haven't said what park I'm going to. I'm not gonna say it. I'm gonna let you figure it out when we get there. You're gonna see, you're gonna love it. This is a hint. Okay, let's eat it. So this is what we've had to result to, to hide the embarrassment of wearing my glasses all day long. And not for nothing, I need the shades. What am I supposed to do? But at least we're in Epco. <laughs> so the mission today is to eat, because I haven't eaten anything yet. And we're just gonna hang out in Epcot today. We're gonna hang out in Epcot together. I just wanted to show you how pretty this is. Look at that. Look how beautiful she is. I don't even want to eat it because it's so pretty. <laughs> it's so good. It's lemony and custardy, and the mousse on top is really good. Off to the next one. Hello, how's it going? Quick update, I decided to sit on this tranquil area because not only will it bring me peace and serenity, but it will also calm me down from this dye that is officially growing in my eye, in the same red eye. So as you can see, it's still red. You can see it's still red. But now there's a cute little sty growing right there. Do you see it? Do you see it? I know you see it. So I decided to sit in this tranquil Japanese garden to calm myself before I completely lose my mind. And now I have more of a reason to continue to walk around like this. I cannot believe there's a sty in my eye. Can you believe that? Like not only is it still red from the contacts, there's a sty, like I feel the swelling. I feel it. Like I, I've been trying to get over it all day long and I've been trying not to think about it because it doesn't hurt like it did yesterday. But now I feel the swelling of the sty. We're in the jungle, in the nightfall, on our own boat. 
hope we survive in the jungles of Mexico. There's also a volcano, which I didn't know Mexico had volcanoes. Fun fact about Chichen Itza, when I was a kid, I actually climbed all the way to the top. I definitely did. Oh, we made it into some ancient ruins. I hope we can survive. Whoa! Journey to soaring. We're gonna soar. We're gonna soar hard. We're gonna soar high. Really fast. Around many different places. Very far. Just a quick update, my eyes still very much red. Wow. Yeah, it's still red, but it's a lot better. I'm sure you've seen the progression. I actually had a good time despite all the little mishaps. My hair, the curls were curling today. She was, she was thriving. Looks like the products were doing their thing. Day two here all the way. And thank you so much for coming with me. I'm so happy that I got to share this experience with you. Oh, thanks so much for being here with me today. I will see you tomorrow on our next adventure. Here's your good night hugs. Yay!